We are off to another night with some snow showers still trying to linger here. Look at this. We get from Newcastle stretching down into Indiana right through Katanning and Butler this line of snow and that's going to leave some uh, quick light accumulations but it could lead to a few slick spots overnight. So if you're doing any of that late night travel, just know you could encounter the snow band as you travel up north. And this one's slowly drifting to the south. And these are going to come to an end by the time we get up tomorrow. So we're pushing the snow out of here. The steadiest of the snow from Indiana to Catanning to Butler, right into Newcastle. And this is Route 422. So this one's lined up right on the roadway there. As for Washington and south, some flurries. These are pretty light at this point. We have mostly cloudy skies here in downtown Pittsburgh. Currently in town, we have 24 degrees. It feels like 12 and our wind chills tonight are going to range between that 10 and 15 degree mark. So just know we're in store for a pretty cold night and wind chills are going to make it feel even colder. 12 is what it feels like in Pittsburgh. Butler feels like 15, 19 Beaver Falls. 17 is what it feels like in Connellsville and Latrobe. Actual temperatures are generally in the mid 20s and we're going to lose a few more degrees before we wake up tomorrow. I think many of us are looking at temperatures down into the teens. So look for these numbers to dip down into the upper teens in Pittsburgh by early tomorrow morning. And again, these wind chills are going to feel like 10 to 15 degrees, so it'll feel colder than what the thermometer says. Temperatures get up to about 30 degrees for a high temperature tomorrow, which is below average. But high pressure is coming in and that's going to give us a pretty quiet day. But look at the left side of your screen. Watch what's coming this way. We get some snow. We get a mix, which could even have a little freezing rain in there and rain. And this is all moving towards Pittsburgh as we head into Saturday. So midnight, Saturday morning, these snow showers start to build towards us. They arrive about 4 or 5 o'clock a.m. We'll see those on and off. And then the big push comes in and we see this transition over to all rain for a good chunk of Saturday afternoon. So we're going to get some snow and even some accumulations. But the rain is going to wash a lot of this away. And a closer view shows that that snow comes in. But by the time we're in the afternoon, we're seeing mainly rain showers here. Temperatures in the mid 40s. Those showers continue into the evening. Then the cold front comes through. That could lead to a flash freeze, which could make for some black ice and some slick spots around on untreated surfaces. Now, when it comes to accumulations, one to two inches for Pittsburgh, two to four around Route 422, getting north of I 84 to six. The important thing to know that most of this is going to get washed away when this changes over to rain, so it's not going to stay on the ground very long. Tonight, 18, mostly cloudy and cold. Tomorrow, you're looking at those temperatures right around 30 degrees for your high temp. Otherwise, partly cloudy skies, a nice quiet day. Saturday, not so quiet. Temperatures make it to 43. That's when we'll be seeing the rain, but leading up to that in the morning, snow showers. Quick accumulations, possibly a brief period of freezing rain before changing to all rain. And then we're going to change it all back to snow by the time we get into Sunday. Those scattered snow showers in 24 degrees there, 25 on Monday, still in the 20s on Tuesday. A little more quiet as we get towards the middle of next week and temperatures do come up a bit still in the 30s for Wednesday and above average come Thursday of next week.